Hey guys, those who have written the gate examination for any of the years from 2019 up to 2023. Yes, again I repeat, from 2019 to 2023, if you have written the gate examination, then do listen to this notification. Yes, Northern Railways has announced, although a contractual post, post but yeah, it can be really important, uh, you know, update for all those who are looking for immediate job and immediate starting. So yes, uh, if you look into this notification, there is a notification floated by Northern Railways and that is for the contractual post of STA that is the senior technical associate in the northern railways and the application of which online date already started from 11th of August and it is there till 28th of August you still have a lot of days left okay so what are the important updates about this notification let me quickly tell you number one Okay, number one, it is purely for four, for the students having the bachelor's degree in the engineering, the four years bachelor degree. So there are majorly the 60 posts as you are able to see here. If you look into this, there are 60 posts for civil engineering. Okay, in the civil department and you need to have four years of uh, civil engineering degree. There are 20 posts in the electrical department and for this you can have the four years bachelor degree, either electrical, electronics and as well as mechanical engineering. If I go to the next... If I go to the next, have a look into this. The next is signal and telecom. And in the signal and telecom, there are total 13 posts. Okay, and for this, you need to have the four years bachelor degree in electrical, electronics, information technology, communication, engineering, or even MSc electronics is applicable here. Now, the very important thing is how is going to be the screening and shortlisted of candidates. As I clearly mentioned, it is purely on the basis of gate score. No extra interview or any other formalities will be required. In addition to that, there will, of course, be a medical examination. But it is purely on the basis of gate score and that is the gate score okay any gate score from 2019 to 2023 okay in the ratio of 1 is to 1 okay that's what i told you know because there is no interview so the selection ratio is directly in the ratio of 1 is to 1 okay 93 posts are there okay so 93 students will be shortlisted total 93 if you count 60 and 20 under 13 okay in other than that there is minimum qualifying marks in your bachelor's degree and that is for general candidate 60 for obc nlc uh, non familiar it is 55 and for SC, ST it is 50. So, you know, these, these are very nominal uh, uh, qualifications that they are expecting from you. Okay, moving ahead to some important points. Yes, age limit is very important. So, you know, many, many, many students, okay, they want to apply for some government or PSU jobs, but they are left behind because of the age criteria. Mostly, you can say for many of the PSUs, it is 27, 28, but in this railway recruitment, okay, the age limit is up to 34 years. Okay, so many students can take the advantage of this particular point as well. Okay, so 20 to 34 years uh, is the age limit. Of course, there are relaxations for OBC candidates of three up to three years and for SCST candidates, there is a relaxation up to the five years. So, this is also important while you are looking about this particular uh, post. Okay, let's move ahead to next important point. Okay, hiring as I clearly told you, there is a contractual hiring but purely on the basis of gate score. That is the only criteria for making up the merit list. There is an application fee of rupees 100. Okay, that's again very nominal but you should be aware about this. Okay, now coming to the very important point, what is going to be your remuneration? First of all, let me tell you that this contract is for a period of one year or as per the extent of the project you are on to working on. Okay, and you will be paid a monthly remuneration. Okay, depending on the city, depending on the city you are recruited into. Okay, and you will be posted anywhere within the jurisdiction of Northern Railway. Okay, so if you are into X class city. Okay, so that is 37,000 X class city as you know is Delhi, uh, Mumbai, Bangalore, etc. Okay, then there are the Y class cities 34,000, Z class cities 32,000. Okay, so based on the city you are posted in, this will be your monthly remuneration. And other than that, you get the, you know, daily allowance, leave entitlement. Uh, so what I've seen the leave, uh, you mostly have a six day working culture here. You have the uh, off on Sunday and national holidays. Okay, and anywhere if you're required to move on from the headquarter to workplace for any of the official duties, you will be uh, getting the remunerations for that. Okay, as I told you, the the contract agreement will be maximum period of one year. Okay, or as, as per the availability of the regular selected candidates or also on the completion of the product or as per directions issued by the railway board from time to time. Okay, so, you know, this is something not earns, earns, this is not something which is certain. And then as I told you about medical fitness, yes, you'll have to go a medical fitness if you are screened. Okay, screening is on the basis of gate score. If you are screened, you have to go undergo, uh, you know, regular medical examination as per the standards of uh, recruitment for any senior technical associate. Okay, and also guys, firstly, wherever you are recruited, you will be undergoing a tech, uh, undergoing a training, okay, which will not be of very big duration, but of course, definitely not less than 10 working days. So, of course, somewhere between 15 days to one month, uh, you can expect a training because 
because you know depends what project uh, you are given into and accordingly you will be trained and then for the complete year you will be working on that particular project okay rest is all uh, the online details how to apply and also you can go through this okay uh, I'll, I'll share this in the telegram also detailed notification so uh, although you know it's contractual basis but for those who are look, looking for immediate job or those who have uh, performed good in 2023 22 21 20 and 2019 and if you are from electronics electrical mechanical or civil any of the branches of course there are more vacancies for civil but yes you can take up the uh, benefit age limit is also very significant there because uh, even up to the 34 years the eligibility is there so you can look into it because gate score were eligible i thought of making this video because students must be aware because it happens sometimes when many students that they lose uh, a job because they were not aware okay so this was just the intention to make you aware and if you find that yes this is of your interest because ultimately it's it's in railway so it can be good opportunity to learn as well and then definitely you can apply if you find it suitable okay thank you stay safe and take care of yourself